three-inch lines, you could be pumping 1,000 gallons a minute at back there instead of 500. Is that wall going to come down now? Possibly. If it gets some more heat, it will. That wall's got to come down when the Maybe. smoke's oh. coming down. Start watching for cracks. Yeah, in fact, that there is a few cracks. So you got where that smoke's coming down that dark thing next to that big garage door all the flames. Yeah. You got a few cracks. There it goes. There, here it goes. Wow. That's where I wish I had my camera. Just gonna drop more lines. Oh. Back here, Luke. Yeah, see, they gotta get these freight cars out of here. Not to interrupt you, but that's the thing they're going to have to watch, that exposure, those tank cars, there's something in there. That's what they're going to start putting water on that to protect that. It's terrifying. You got You're a volunteer firefighter. Yeah. They've got about 40,000 gallons and who knows what the hell's in those things. I see that guy, he's going to release the brake on there to get them out of there. In these tanks all yeah, over here? he's releasing the brake on those railroad What's cars? in those? You don't know? I don't know. And what about in there? What was all That was there? all in, that building was... Uh, furniture, mattresses, and regular house furniture. I was getting so into it, I missed what you said. Were there workers in there? They just ran out like you said? Oh, I imagine the workers were out because when I pulled out of Powell Dufferin, they were out. But see, he's releasing those railroad cars to get them out of there. You're going to probably get more of a wall collapse there. See how the wall's cracked over the window there? That's all going to go. Let's see what he's got here, this booster line, that's a joke, that's 30 gallons a minute, which is going to be, and you see them putting 5,000 to 1,000 gallons a minute over there, that's shit already compared to what that thing's going to do. Yeah, this looks like a garden hose. It's going to be like pissing on it. See now? Yeah, see, he's wetting it. That's what I was saying there, more or less, what I was referring to is like protecting the exposures. But that there is like nothing. They should really have a deck gun on it, which is probably what they're going to do. See, they're setting that up? Yeah. That's, he'll probably put that on now, as soon as they get water into this engine. And fire it on the cars. Yeah. See, but he's got a problem. He's going to cut these hoses if he goes much further. He can't run over these hoses. He's limited to how far he can go. Well, you don't think the fire will spread much in that building, right? Well, they're going to start watching Hess. Because you got, see how you got heat here? Yeah. You have what they call radiant heat, and that's what will spread the fire. That's why, like I said, if there's stuff in those tank cars, and they don't keep them protected, those tank cars will go. See, now they got cars over there, which they may start. See how the um, sparks and everything are going towards them? Yeah. So they got to start watching things like that, because if stuff like that starts going, then that's what could spread the fire if they don't protect it. That, well, that's what I was telling you before about protecting the exposures. If that tank car gets hot and there's something flammable in it, it's just going to go sky high and we're going with it. See, unfortunately, he can't move these railroad tank cars further. I don't get how one hose can stop that from getting hot. Well, that hose there is too small of a line. What they're going to probably do, see they're setting up here with these lines? They're going to put a deck gun on that. That'll be five hundred. How come they're allowing people to come this close? Usually they Yeah, I know. These people here that are over here, they might end up working in the building. These people here. See, he's laying out. He's going to have a death gun on that. That's... Talk with him. I'm listening. Oh, he's going to have about 500 gallons a minute going on that tank car to prevent it from exploding.